You are about to begin your DynaSplint instructional video, but just a note before we start. Most of the time, DynaSplint systems are a rental product, and you are responsible to return it at the end of your treatment so that you're not charged for the replacement cost of the splint. When your doctor, therapist, and DynaSplint sales consultant agree that your treatment is complete, please view the simple How to Return Your DynaSplint video located at the bottom of this page. The shipping's prepaid and your label's in the box. Now, let's get started. Congratulations, and thank you for choosing DynaSplint to help improve your range of motion. We hope this video is helpful as you apply, wear, and remove your DynaSplint systems. Thank you, and we hope to stretch beyond your expectations. To apply the patient's ankle DynaSplint, open all front cuffs and straps. Place the patient's foot on the foot plate with the patient's heel touching the back heel strap. Close straps in order. First, the two inch shin strap, then the top thin blue butterfly strap, then the lower thin blue butterfly strap, Finally, the large shin cuff. Pull straps and cuff to the line that the DynaSplint consultant marked on each cuff and strap. Place a pillow under the patient's calf to float the heel. To remove the ankle DynaSplint, follow the numbers marked on each cuff by the sales consultant. First, the two inch shin strap, then the top thin blue butterfly strap, then the lower thin blue butterfly strap, finally, the large shin cuff. Gently remove the patient's foot and ankle from the DynaSplint. Please reclose all straps and cuffs when the DynaSplint is not in use. The patient should be inactive and relaxed while wearing the DynaSplint. Start by having the patient wear the ankle DynaSplint for one to two hours. Build the wearing time up to four hours a day. When the patient is comfortable, the goal should be the splint worn for six to eight hours within each 24 hour period. After wearing, check for any swelling or red marks that do not go away after 30 minutes. If this occurs, or if you have any questions about the tension still addressing the tone of the foot, please contact your DynaSplint representative. 